rock in some sunlight. There's a chuck waller right there. Stuff. Cold, cold the days to drink water, get sunlight, and pee on a cactus. There's a bee on your butt. Bad bee. Nope. This is no this is me. This is you. Every trip's a herping trip, even when it's not a herping trip. This rock is Jesus, a nutty terrain. Oh, this is like Choya Alley, buddy. Uh, I gotta get all these damn Choyas out of my shoes. No, you mean that, that that couch recliner behind me? I just gotta lean back. <laughs> lean back. Get jacked. We do some rock and roll right now. Literally. Yeah, ow. Dang it, I got Choyed. Don't do that. Bad cactus manners. Move out of the way, buddy. Flying Choya. What was that? Is he coming out? No. Okay. Where's he going? He's going that way. All right. I see me a Chuck. So ah! He smacked me. He's a smacker. There we go. Happy the Chuck. Yeah, this, this guy is not too happy with me. He's so angry. Even though we we're only out for a sunshine walk today, the moral of the story is, it's always a good time to herp. No adventure too short. There's always an adventure. An angry black and white Oreo colored adventure that wants to bite the crap out of you. Okay. That's why Chakawala, the world's most peaceful creature. Yo, do you need help? I'm kind of sad, so I gotta let my pet parrot go. Come, okay, you ready? You ready? You ready to jump? <laughs> All right. My pet parrot left. That's the thing about scaly parrots, okay? They're not loyal at all. First sign of a rock and they run, jump for it, and you're left all alone again. It's about, about as physical as I'm getting today. What do you mean as physical as we're getting today? Our truck's all the way down there, look. Right there, that, that, that okay, little- Okay, what I meant was, that's as physical as I'm getting today because you guys are carrying me out. All right. Okay, come get me. Why is the ground so hot? I'm just gonna leave you to burn there. <laughs> well, that just bacon. means my tan will be better than yours. Cool, I'll get to eat some bacon. <laughs> we just found this rock here on the hill. Uh, is that the falcon or the eagles? The eagles are green, right? Okay, I do not know my football team. So first of all, if you already insulted me, Shame on you, okay? I'm out chasing things in the wilderness, okay? I'm looking for real these, not people who wear pictures of these on their uniform, okay? If found, please post on Casa Grande Rocks and rehide. All right, I am right here. The rock was right there. And they said rehide. Rehide it by shell. There we go. Consider that rock rocked with his new friend, The Rock. And I'm gonna go this way. Hopefully I don't fall to my damn death. Good. I can carry it. Do I turn off this? Let's go back down. We stayed up for too long. Yep. All right. First of all, that hurt. Second of all, I might have broke some bones or something. I don't know. But it looks pretty roughed up. I might have broke a rib. It smashed my ribs. I might have broke part of my ankle or hurt my ankle. It's kind of swollen and funky there now. I don't know. So we'll find out. Catch you guys in the next episode. Please comment, like, subscribe, and don't break your damn self. Ow. After that near-death experience, um, and I really mean near-death experience, I broke three ribs, I separated two of them, and I did serious heart damage on that fall. You guys can't tell because I walked away, um, but it almost killed me. I, I went to the to the doctor and he's like, you need to go to the ER because you might need surgery. And I'm basically, well, my family can't afford that and if I die, they're gonna get stuck with a medical bill. So I'm like, whatever, I'm just gonna eat healthy. Uh, take take some exercise time off and see if my body will heal and see how it goes But my heart was actually bouncing off the broken ribs in my chest So um, it was literally and I'm not even kidding a near fatal experience for me So in the future I'm going to be taking some of the smaller things more serious because I you know Like like most of you you probably assume tall falls big things and uh, you know that rock was only like 
maybe maybe eight nine feet tall at the top and then what it ended up happening was i climbed up took it for granted tried to step onto that post and fell six feet right onto my chest i mean it nearly it nearly ended me so um unfortunately for you guys that massively hurt how many videos we we were able to record this year so we are going to be a little bit short um so we might run out of videos trying to do two a month maybe sometime in in, in January, not exactly sure, but we have several good videos recorded already. So um, see you guys in the future uh, with some other cool videos. And if we're a little short, don't worry, we're not stopping. I just needed time to heal. And that wasn't the only bad thing that happened. Every other thing I'm keeping on the down low, but that was not the only ass whooping I took this year. Um, getting beat down left and right, physically, emotionally, financially, because this year was just a bad year. But I'm keeping, I'm keeping at it. Love you guys. See you soon.